Hey guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes. I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise. Today we got a love slash sex matches. Just one will be for Aries. Aries, I started to shuffle for you and literally the star card wants to slap me in my face. It is in reverse, okay? So I literally heard fatal attraction, okay? You could be connecting with an Aquarius or any air sign for that matter, but I'm getting a fatal attraction is happening here and a connection with someone that you're with, okay? I'm getting the sound of their voice or the thought of them makes you irritated. I'm getting, I'm getting actually, you're actually not even turned on by this person, okay? Okay, with the star card in reverse, you you can be feeling uninspired by love. Okay, you feel like love has done you wrong, left you on the cold, hurt you. Okay, I feel like you have nothing left to pour out of you when it comes to the love department. You're looking for your cup to be filled. You're not looking to fill anybody else's cup. Okay, I'm 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 hearing that Aaliyah song, "Wish Upon a Star." I wonder where you are. I feel like someone is wishing for the love of their life. Okay, someone's making a wish. I hear make a wish, Marlon. Say cheese. Okay, so um, it, it could be someone's birthday right now. Okay, and you wish that you were with them. You miss them. Okay. Okay, moving on. Okay, you could be connecting with Aquarius. You want to be with an Aquarius for their birthday, Aries. Something like that. Okay, can I get a card, please, for why is the star card the card for Aries in their love life? Why is this the card, please, for Aries in their love life? Aww. I got the, I got the sun card. Okay, so I'm getting... You could be definitely connecting with a, a, a Leo, Aries. You missed this, you missed this Leo. You want to be with them or or an Aquarius. Okay, but I'm also I'm also getting I'm also getting that You guys could have broken up and that was the best solution for you guys to walk away, leave each other. Okay, I'm getting it's only been 5 days since you guys been broken up. If I turn the star card around, Aries, it would give me a different message. It would make me feel compelled to say that someone inspires you. They make you feel good. Someone is in love or enamored by your looks or your body. Okay? They love the shape. They love they love everything about your body or your looks, okay? I'm also getting that this person um They could probably really take care of themselves health-wise, okay? They eat good, they work out, or they take vitamins, okay? This person can inspire you to be a better person, take care of yourself better, focus on your health or something like that. I'm also getting Aries. This could be a wish come true. You wished, you wished for a Leo and you got them. Now, like I said, you I, I literally hear like two things. First of all, if you're wishing for something, it's going to be given to you. I, I feel like I feel like in the next five months you could be meeting someone or in the next five months, whatever is happening in your relationship is going to clear up, it's going to get better, things are gonna be resolved, you guys are gonna come back together, you guys are gonna feel more inspired by love, to love each other, to work things out, to communicate, to find balance, okay? I'm also I'm also getting Aries, you need to check your um now, I don't know if this is for you, Aries, or for someone else, but I feel like you need to check your 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 sun sign. I feel like you're really not an Aries. You're a Leo. Or you act like a Leo. Now you could have you can have rising in in you can have rising in Leo or rising in Aquarius. You act like that sign other than a than a than a, a Aries. Can I get a sex card, please? And other messages, please. Could you tell me why? 
The star card is here, please, for Aries. Thank you. It says, drunk, high sex turns me on. So, okay, the star card The star card could be for, um, being video recorded, being on camera, taking pictures of yourself, okay? It also could be masturbating as well. Okay, the thought of someone um, makes you, you like to masturbate of the thought of someone or the memory of someone. Okay, and drunk high sex turns me on. So I'm getting that you guys could definitely be uh, connecting with a, a Leo or an Aquarius. They like to get ine inebriated. They like to get fucked up. I'm getting that brings out their freaky side. I'm also, I'm also, I'm also going to tell you this because I just heard this. Aries, I feel like there's a bet on you. I feel like someone's putting a bet on you that they could get you drunk and get you to take off your clothes or get you high or get you, you know, inebriated and, and they can expose you or get you to take pictures or something like that or get you to do freaky shit when you're under the influence. Ah. Can I get a card, please, for the sun? Why is the sun card here, please? Now, someone someone can have really good sex when they're actually um, drunk. I, I feel like uh, liquor, weed, I don't know. Shit, this could be fucking cocaine for all I know. I feel like some something when some type of substance brings the freak out of someone, okay? Can I get a card, please, for the sun card? Sorry for the growling. I got puppies running around everywhere. Can I get a card, please, for the sun card, please, for Aries? Why is the sun card here? Now, Aries, you could definitely be missing someone here, okay? And this is causing you to drink, get high, okay? I'm, I'm also getting that you're replacing sadness or depression with sex and drugs, okay? Can I get a card, please, for the sun card? Why is the sun card here, please? Family friend. Ooh, Family, friend. So you could be meeting this person. You could be, like I told you, for those of you that's getting ready to meet someone in the next five months, big energy of Leo. I'm getting that this a family member is going to introduce you to this person. Okay? You guys could be going out for drinks, going out to party, just simply hanging out. Okay? I'm getting mind your conduct around around someone's family because I'm, I'm getting that someone here has the ability to be too promiscuous around family, especially if someone's inviting you around their family. I don't know, moving on. Can I get cards please for the sun? Thank you. It says, shut up, you're loud. Okay, and says, fucking all night. So I'm getting, I'm, <laughs> I'm getting that the, if you're connecting with the Leo, okay, I'm getting that someone performs in the bedroom, okay? They get like all actor or actress like, okay? I'm actually getting that you may live with your family or I, I feel like if you live with your family, someone is too loud during sex, especially if they're high and drunk. Now you could be having sex and, and, and waking up family members, whether this is uh, sister, brother, husband, children. You could be having drunk sex and waking someone up. This could be happening over the weekend. I'm also getting I'm also getting that um someone in your family could be exposing you Like, I feel like someone is telling all your secrets about like a night that you got drunk and who you fucked that night. I feel like someone is airing out your business, but you know, we're gonna move on from that. <laughs> Can I get one last card, please, for Aries and regarding their love life? Can I get can I get one card, please? For Aries regarding their love life, please. So I'm also getting that, um, and any air sign, but I have big Aquarius energy, but I feel like someone could be trying to come up with a plan or a strategy to like get you to have sex with them unprotected. Okay. I'm getting someone is telling you to shut up. Like, I, I feel like someone, I, I feel like someone is forcing you to have sex with them because you're high, because you're drunk. 
Okay, I'm getting now you can you could possibly want to have sex unprotected, but I'm I'm getting that Aries, if you're connecting with an air sign, okay, I'm getting that I'm getting that you should definitely protect yourself sexually, especially if you fucking someone's wife or husband. Cause I'm also I'm also getting that someone that acts like their friends or acts like their brother and sister or act like their family, but really they're fucking. Okay, that's what I got for you.